Hi kindergarten! I'm going to show you how to play a very fun math game. It's called The Great Race. To play for two people, you will need a game board, a die, and each player will need three pawns. I took these from Parcheesi. You could also use coins or bottle caps. Each player chooses three numbers on the game board and puts his or her pawn next to those numbers. The goal is to race to the middle where the smiley face is. The first player rolls the dice. A six has been rolled. Both players look at the board and decide what plus six equals seven? That would be a one. The player who's on the one gets to move one space, trying to get closer and closer to the smiley face. Now it's the next player's turn. A one. One plus six equals seven. So the player whose pawn is next to the six gets to move one space. Back to the first player's turn. Five. Five plus two is seven. The game continues. Five plus two equals seven. So eventually one player gets to go to the middle. There are lots of variations to this game. This game board is for partners of six. You play it exactly the same way as the previous board, which was for partners of seven, except this time there's two threes on the board, reviewing that three plus three equals six is a doubles fact. So the player who has a blue pawn needs to be at a three, and the player who has a yellow pawn needs to be at a three to make it fair. Just like before, the first player rolls the dice. A two has been rolled. Two plus four equals six. So the person who has a four gets to move his pawn or her pawn. Five. Five plus one equals six. So here is the one that person gets to move. Two plus four equals six. So it's this person's chance again. And you keep rolling until someone gets to the middle. If a three is rolled, because it's a doubles fact, both players get to move their pawns. If a six is rolled, no one moves their pawn because zero is not on the game board. This variation is for partners of 10. Whoever goes first rolls the dice. A four has been rolled. Four plus six equals 10, so the person who has a pawn on the 6 gets to move. Now it's the second player's turn. A 2 has been rolled. What goes with 2 to get to 10? The answer is 8. The player with the 8 gets to go. And you keep rolling. 
and moving until someone gets to the middle. The last variation is pretty different. For this one, you're going to be adding on to five. It's called the Great Race for Five Plus. You're going to need two different colors, pens or markers or crayons, and a paper clip to be your spinner. The players have to decide which three numbers they are going to be looking for, and they're going to have to mark that with their color. So one player might choose 10, 5, and 6, and the other player chooses 9, 8, and 7. Okay, it's player one's turn. Use your pencil or whatever you're working with and your paper clip and spin a number. Five plus four equals nine. So the player who has a nine gets to mark it with their color. Getting closer and closer, of course, to your finish. Now it's the next player's turn. Zero. Five plus zero equals five. So this player who has the five gets to mark an X. Keep playing. Up. Oh, five plus zero equals five. And you keep playing and marking until somebody gets to the middle. I hope you have fun playing this game at home. Miss you lots.